Hey guys, this is Dan uh, from Jailbreak Zone. I was going to show you the smartwatch tweak that's available. It's still in a beta 0.86 from Robert Heath. It costs $3.99 and it also requires iOS 6 and uh, your, have a Pebble watch. So there's nine functionalities that are included in Smartwatch Plus, as you can see right there. And he's going to add more functionality in future updates. Go ahead and swipe over here to the Smartwatch icon, as you can see. If I select that one, that's the Pebble Watch app. If you hit, their, hit your Smartwatch app, this, these are the nine options that you have. And you can, uh, you can edit them. You hit edit mode, and then I can pick this, and I can slide it in the order that I want it, or I can also have it uh, disabled completely. Uh, there's also some additional functionality. Uh, you, you can turn on or off, or you can get weather for certain locations. Um, you can have different Bitcoin information. Uh, you can also have different stock screen. Uh, you can have which uh, stock you want to know about. So I just left Apple in there. That's the standard one. Uh, there's also information in your calendar and other things like that. So I'll go ahead and pull up my watch here. As you can see, um, I have Bitcoin information available on it. Let me go back to the home screen for my watch. Uh, so these are the different watch faces I have installed on here. And then if I press this, it'll bring me to a music, mic, music app. And I can see where Bitcoin uh, is trading right now. Uh, press the middle button to update. I press this down one doesn't do anything on this particular one again this will update if you press it here in the middle uh, take a picture so let's go ahead and try to do that jumps right into my camera app so I have it open as you can see now I'll go ahead and switch to launch Shuri. What do you think of the Pebble Watch? It's nice of you to ask, Daniel, but it doesn't really matter what I think. Well, I said the Pebble Watch, and what I said, what do I think of the iWatch? So, anyway, I have the ability to end calls and those kinds of things as well through Suri. See if you already have Suri activated. It doesn't know what to do. So if I press this top one, it'll launch it, and if I press the bottom one, it'll exit it. Try that again here. Hmm. Quite sure exactly. The same one opens it and closes it, and the middle one's for answering a phone call. Uh, when you access your music, I can adjust the volume for my watch. I also get information on humidity, temperature outside, my battery percentage, and that kind of information also on my watch. So, as you can see, it's additional functionality for your iWatch or for your Pebble Watch or future. Uh, I haven't got iOS 7 installed yet on my phone, so I'll uh, do some testing on that to see what kind of functionality is involved on your uh, on your watch. Other than that, um, this is a pretty nice little tweak. If you have a Pebble watch, you can have a few more things sent to your watch. You don't have to dig out your phone to find out what the Apple stock's at or if you want to access Surrey or whatever else. So I uh, just thought I'd share this with you. Head over to jailbreakzone.com, or you can also follow us on Twitter and on YouTube at Jailbreak Zone. Be sure to subscribe and follow us. Thanks.